in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I make over $200 a day with my DeFi portfolio. Welcome back to the Blockchain Ben YouTube channel, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in today. In this video, we are going to be going through my entire portfolio. Now, I do not have a ton of plays running right now, but these are just the main ones that are printing daily profits for me. Let me know in the comment section what you think I should add to this portfolio. Maybe subtract, you never know. And also make sure you guys like this video. Before I jump into this, I am not a financial advisor. None of this is financial advice. Everything in crypto and DeFi is insanely risky, guys. So please, never invest more than you can afford to lose. Always do your own research and know exactly what you guys are going into before you go into any project in this space. Incredibly risky, guys. That being said, let's jump right into this. And I just want to start here at the top with my current top project, which is Gray Fund. Currently, I have $20,000 in Gray Fund right now. The APY is going to be variable on this one. The average monthly APR has been roughly 15.5%. That is going to lead to a total monthly profit after the 15% cut that Gray takes and after the $200 fee of roughly $2,473. Now it could be higher, it could be lower, depending on the monthly returns, which is my highest daily profit in at $82.45. My current portfolio right now, DeFi wise, is at $76,000 right now. Our average monthly APR for all of these combined is 9.14%. So it is very possible to get close to 10% monthly yields in lower risk plays, which is incredible. And that is exactly how I've tried to build this portfolio out. There's going to be some that are slightly more risky than others. Of course, Gray Fund is going to be custodial, so you can't just take out your funds at any point in time. You do have to have a level of trust with those. But there are a lot of these projects that you do not need to put your funds in the hands of other people. You can have complete and full access to them. And that is where a lot of the lending and liquidity pools are going to come in that I'm going to talk about later. But Gray Fund, absolutely fantastic project. We have talked about this one a ton here on the channel. Make sure you watch my other videos if you have not watched them on this yet. Very, very bullish on Gray Fund still. They are almost at 51 million in the fund balance currently. Lifetime deposits of 32 million, lifetime withdrawn of 21 million. I will be very excited once this lifetime withdrawn crosses over lifetime deposits and we will have and we will have full confirmation of this project being 100% real. So super excited for that. Until then, I am just taking profits on my monthly. Might take out a little bit of capital just as this project rolls. But next project that is on the list is going to be a private project. So I cannot talk about that one, but that is going to be making about 10% per month. There's a ton of these other ones that are making me roughly 10% per month. So you can always substitute that with any one of these if you guys do want to copy my portfolio. Delisium is my next one. Now this one has been running for a long time. So it's not one that really has an entry currently. You can buy the token and stake it if you want. But way back when I bought seven DMA nodes for $7,000, currently those nodes are each worth about $2,500. Those are making me 126 AGI per day. Token price was at about 30 cents. Now after this kind of big dip is at roughly 20 to 25 cents. So I can adjust the numbers there, but that's roughly $40 per day just off of Delisium. That was over a year ago. So some of these plays, guys, especially if they are long-term real projects, can have some long-term output, just like Delisium has shown. It's been over a year. They've already had a halving from their DMA. So I'm only making half of the tokens I was, and I'm still making an awesome, awesome over $1,000 per month from this project. Also, if you guys do want to buy the token and stake it, you can do so on the Delisium website almost 8 million staked here with an estimated APR of 131%. So you can get really good yield over there on your Delisium, especially if you're holding that, might as well jump over there and stake it. Next one, this is going to be a new project that I've yet to talk about on the channel, but I really, really like it. Now this is going to be from the developer that created Dex Finance. So 
really good developer here. He created a brand new Dex and it's a much smaller one, only about 2 million in total value locked. But this is a guy who I have worked with in the past. I've worked with his project Dex Finance a long time ago and he is pretty well known in this space. So this is going to be Cedo Swap, which I'm going to pull up in just one second here. But I have around 4,200 in capital here that is earning an average APY of 361% monthly APR of 12.68% and daily of 0.425%. That is going to leave me with about $17 per day from this. If I increase this position size, which I'm definitely thinking about it, I could earn a lot more per day on this. And this is going to be in an Ethereum and USDC pool. Cedo swap. So here we go. It is going to be on the Manta network. Now this is not going to be your average decks. It's more going to be farming these Cedo tokens, which the price of Cedo does have to stay at a certain point for you to be earning these APRs. So the price is very solid right now. And like I was saying, this is a very healthy project. Currently, you can see all of the farms over here. This is Cedo swap. So they have Cedo 404. You can trade over here farms bridge very very small little decks here but over 2 million in total value locked right now and these pools are insane right now you can do us decks plus slash usdc which is a stable pool for 131.73 percent apr now these aprs can change they can fluctuate especially if the price of the cedo token goes down these could go down pretty quickly as well so this isn't going to be one that you're going to set it and forget it and you know don't take profits for multiple weeks or whatever this is one that you're going to want to monitor make sure that the apr is where you want it to be and then once you know the apr kind of falls out of the range of what's really going to be worth it for you keeping your money in there i think i'll probably pull mine out when the apr hits like 60 70 80 percent or so because i know i can get that in other places then i will move my funds out of it but we are here for a good time not a long time on this one as you can see we currently have our USDC wrapped Ethereum right here. Now, this is going to show a little bit less than what we had on the Excel sheet. That is just because of some impermanent loss right there, which I can make a whole nother video about, explain a little bit more about liquidity farming. But we have so far earned $4.36, and I just claimed this a couple of hours ago. First time I claimed, I know I made close to $20 on that, and that was just after a day. But 153% APR on your USDC and wrapped Ethereum, you cannot beat that. If you want to go into the other pools, you can as well. However, they're going to be with the CEDO token, so it is going to be a lot more risky, a lot more volatile. But if you want to do that, be my guest and go for it. So this is more farming i would say and more staking it's not exactly liquidity farming because you're not earning the fees technically but this is a really awesome protocol right now that is printing for these and there's no deposit fee no withdrawal fee only three hundred and three thousand in total liquidity right here so awesome opportunity if you guys want to hop over here on cedo swap so i'm earning roughly twenty dollars a day on that one Next is going to be extra fi where I am lending out my USDC and USD plus for my USDC. I have 17,500 in there with an APY of 42.29%. This can be a monthly APR of almost 3% daily APR of 0.1 or 0.01% or actually, sorry, 0.1%. That is going to lead to an average of about 17 and a half dollars a day. My USD plus landing, I made a video about this the other day. I believe it actually went live yesterday from when you guys are seeing this video. My USD, this is going to be a stable coin that is buy overnight finance. So it is going to be kind of an algorithmic stable coin. If you guys want to learn a little bit more, go back to my last video on the channel. But I currently have around 13,500 in this that is printing an APY of 107.77%. I'm be showing you guys that in just a second. That equates to about $28 in daily profit, so almost $30 here. The thing that I like about this portfolio that I've built is the vast majority of it is going to be in very stable assets, an Ethereum pool. Both of these stable coins are very stable. Gray Fund is going to just be in US dollar based. So you're not really gonna have too much in the fluctuations of your daily profits. Now, I'll talk about the SUI pool in a second, but that one will have some fluctuations. So let's hop over to here, look at extra finance right now. I actually need to switch my network once again. 
But as you can see, just from the early glimpse of this, the APYs are really, really solid. So this is going to change as the days go on. USD Plus is only at 55% APY right now. I know I showed in one of my last videos, is that like 120 or 160 or whatever. It'll change by the minute as it is based off of the total supply and the total borrowed and the percentage of utilization that is going to determine the interest rate model. But I am staking my USDC and USD Plus. I have it half split up into one wallet, half split up into another wallet, so you can't see it totally here. USDC is at 43.91%. We can go on data here, go to 30 days, see that it's 43.46% is the 30 day average for the APY. For the USD Plus, I believe this was at like 120% earlier today when I checked. 30 day APY is going to be at 105.66%. So both of those are going to be really solid options for lending. That USD plus is going to be earning you a ton, especially if it can stay at those high APYs. Currently it's a little bit down, but it's just something that fluctuates over time. It's all about the average with those. Finally, the last one that we are going to be talking about is this SUI pool. Now this is a little bit of liquidity farming or liquidity pool farming. This is something I want to get a lot more into. I've been into this in the past. I've tried a whole bunch of different strategies and such. And nowadays I've seen a major, major uptick in volume on a bunch of these newer chains. And there are a lot of pools that are going to be very, very profitable for us as a community. So I'm really excited to do a lot more research on this, bring you guys some incredible opportunities and make a whole bunch of videos on these. But this SUI pool, right here i had about ten thousand dollars in it ever since these last two days where we have had some huge huge crashes in the prices of coins i have ran into a lot of impermanent loss there so it's definitely something that i need to figure out what i want to do with that in my future positions because currently i'm my thought process is i'm just going to hold suey you know it's going to be a really good bull market bag but at the same time you don't want to have a lot of your funds, close to $10,000 locked up in just SUI, sitting there for the long term, just so that it can recover back to its original prices. But what I did is I actually redeployed a little bit of that capital into a new position. This is going to be concentrated liquidity farming. If you guys are not too familiar with this, I can do a video on this in the future. You can earn a lot more, but you have to know what you're doing because it is pretty complex and if you set the stuff up wrong it is going to lead to a lot of lost money so you have to learn this you have to do your research with these positions as well and the way that you set your ranges currently though i am farming on turbos right now and i'm in range for 747 percent apr oh now we're into it total liquidity in this is about two thousand dollars that i put in we have $28 in unclaimed rewards, and I set this pool up, I want to say yesterday. It may have even been a little bit before that. So 1.5% pretty much a day, you know, don't kill me, I'm not, I'm not stable fund here anymore, but this is a real 1.5% a day here as long as we stay within this range. Now currently, I had this earlier range here that was set from about $2 down to about a dollar 40 cents was in that range for a while i only started it right around here so it kept creeping down creeping down down until it finally broke this and it broke again today so i rebalanced my position this is currently where i'm at from about a dollar 54 cents to roughly a dollar and four cents so as long as we can stay within there especially because there's not a lot of liquidity right here because the majority of the liquidity is right up here we can farm some incredible apys right now so when these tokens are cheap it is often a good time to start your liquidity farm because you will have a little bit of price appreciation if it goes up while it is within your lp especially those v3 lps which i can make a whole video on go on for a while but i do not want to make that the subject of this video one more thing is that if you guys want to find some really solid liquidity pools highly recommend you guys check out crystal.app it's a really really cool website over here where you can go on pretty much any network find the top pools over there like just base chain for example if we hop on a base chain it'll load for a little bit 
534.28% on wrapped ETH and USDC. Now, this could be a concentrated liquidity pool. You have to see how tight the ranges are for these, but that is incredible yield on some blue chip assets right there. So yes, it says on Uniswap V3, a lot of times you can click into here as well, set your own ranges too. So you can come over here and click best wide, full range, best narrow, it will give you a lot of different options. You can even deposit your liquidity over here and zap it in right there. That average earning, normally it works. This definitely seems to be a little bit off. I mean, if it's not, I'm jumping into here right now picking up my 86,000 a day. That would be incredible, but I highly doubt that is going to be the case with this. But really, really cool website over here if you guys want to find a little bit more. Also wanna give a huge shout out to Crypto Labs Research. This guy is absolutely awesome. He's taught me a bunch about LPs, and I've really been watching just a ton of his videos, so shout out to him. Make sure you guys go give him a subscription over there. Check out some of his other videos. He has some really awesome content really cool dude as well. But guys, that was going to be my first portfolio update. Let me know if you guys want me to do more of these. I really think that this could be something that could grow and we could keep snowballing onto this and see how far we could take this portfolio. I would love to see this thing hit six figures. That would be absolutely incredible. And I don't think that we're gonna be that far away from it because once you get this thing rolling, it is like a snowball. It is just going to pick up more and more and more. Let me know if you guys want to copy any of these positions. Thank you all so much. And I will see you all in the next video.